y'all. I'm going to show you how to survive in a corporate world. Oh, excuse my manners in case you don't know me. Hi, hi. I'm Clarissa, Clarissa Jones. And again, um, I'm going to show you how to survive in a corporate world 101. I got my notes here. So first, get a job application. Second, look at the application and read it. That's very important. Number three, third, if it's for you, fill it out and turn it in. Let me tell you, it ain't worth it, but let's keep going. Fourth, step four, once you turn in the application, worry the employer to death until they say yes. Don't just call. Go there and bother them. Like, literally just bother them. Don't touch them and get physical, but just bother them and say, look, I need a job. I got bills to pay, yada, yada, yada. You know how to talk to people. Um, number five, once they finally say yes and give you the handbook and paperwork, Make sure you read the fine print, like stuff like benefits, um, when you're going to get paid, how you're going to get paid, that's important. HR department on how they solve issues. Again, look in your handbook, especially about the HR part, to see on how they solve issues. There's a video of me explaining all about HR, in case you didn't know. Um, about FMLA, etc. Don't sign anything till you read. You got two eyes, four eyes if you wear glasses like me. Um, read. Don't just look at it and fill it out. Read what you're filling out because, again, it will bite you in the butt unexpectedly. And most importantly, number six, once you start working, remember your co workers are not your friend. Again, your co-workers are not your friends. They're just acquaintances struggling just like you are trying to pay their bills. Also, your boss is not your friend, even though they say that you're like family. And most importantly, most importantly, just mind your business and be about your business. Oh, I like that part when I wrote down, be about your business. Clock in work, go to break, go to the bathroom, clock out. Also, most importantly, once you work there a long periods of time and you realize that your PTO is like stacking up and you're afraid to take vacation, take your vacation, take a time off for your mental health because that's very, very important. So, I hope all of this helped because... I mean, there's no simpler than that, but the corporate world, just read. That is the biggest thing, is just read and understanding, because I'm telling you this because it happened to me before. I get so excited about getting the job and just filling out everything and then not reading the, like, the fine print on the bottom. Yeah, just read. So, I hope that helps. Bye, genius.